the demating of of Leonardo actually took place at 4.50 a.m. Central. You can see uh, some sped up video of the move thus far here. And this is about eight times the true speed of the uh, robotics work, which is always, of course, done very slowly and carefully to make sure that nothing is damaged as the move progresses. Again, it was actually uh, detached from its uh, former Earth-facing Unity port and is now well on its way to the Tranquility port. It's scheduled to be made at around 8 a.m. Central Time. View here of the uh, permanent multipurpose module again in mid-flight at the end of the station's Canada Arm 2 being controlled by robotics officers here on the ground, not only in Houston at Mission Control, but also uh, in Canada at the Canadian Space Agency's Mobile Servicing Systems Operations Center in Quebec. The robotics officers here on the ground report that they are now uh, moving the permanent multipurpose module into a distance about 40 centimeters or 15 inches from its new home on uh, the forward tranquility port. What is now the uh, permanent multipurpose module started life as the Leonardo multipurpose logistics module and uh, was used basically as a moving van for cargo being sent up to the space station inside the payload bay of the space shuttle. It first launched in 2001 on board STS-102 and flew on a total of eight shuttle missions, including its last, STS-133, in 2011, when it was delivered as a permanent fixture and installed on Unity. Okay, let's say a couple things. The uh, 4.0 is serial number 2Mike0063. It's in uh, no 2 forward right now. Okay, we copy. Thanks. So I found uh, uh, something in one of the CTVs with the space drums bottles. It's called an electronic unit blind panel. And the barcode is Mike, Echo, Foxtrot, Oscar, Echo, Bravo, 30, Juliet. Good morning. I uh, think I am complete. Unless you have uh, something else for me. Thank you very much, Samantha. Great job. And thanks for your comments to the improved public procedure as well. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you. Thanks for the support. And uh, I'm glad we were able to uh, put the cover back on. I had a doubt at some point. So all is good. Thanks. Robotics officers here on the ground are happy with the alignment of the permanent multipurpose module and now getting ready to move it into what's called the ready to latch position. The permanent multipurpose module is now installed on the tranquility node. That uh, final second stage capture that marks the installation took place at 8.08 .08 a.m. Central Time as the station was flying 252 miles of over Paraguay.